from News 13. The latest on the day's top stories, county by county coverage, and weather on the ones. This is your evening news weather now. A person becoming a U.S. citizen is not something commonly seen by most Americans, but on Wednesday, nearly 100 Girl Scouts witnessed this important event so that they could learn more about two timely topics, citizenship and immigration. News 13's Erin Murray was there for the ceremony. This is the an orange patch, and then this one is from... Teresa Woodall is proud of each and every batch. This one is from the citizenship ceremony. With Several Girl Scout troops from across Central Florida came to watch 30 people become U.S. citizens Wednesday. And I saw some of them crying of joy. You don't get to see this a lot. The idea for the girls to experience this came from Teresa Finer, a lawyer and Girl Scout mother. When I went around to their troops, I asked them, Does any, has anybody heard about citizenship? in the you know on the news and all hands shot up everybody's heard about it but they didn't know anything about it and many girls admit that was true well not a lot <laughs> like I, th I thought they would just take an oath but they have to also take tests I didn't know that and took like a couple sample questions I got all of them wrong it wasn't it was not good and now walking out I know a lot more and I bet I could ace it and they didn't just watch they said the Pledge of Allegiance and to the Republic for which it stands they sang and even shared in the emotion. I cried like twice. I'm proud to be a part of it. Each of them certainly earning their badge as 30 others earned their citizenship. It's like a, a once in a lifetime opportunity to see this happen. And it's like, it's like an important thing that happens in our country that we got to witness. In Orlando, I'm Erin Murray with News 13. The Orange County Bar Association invited all the troops to take part in National Law Week. It's an annual event to educate people about law and its role in society.